exciting, exciting new things coming to the homestead. Stay tuned. Guys, I gave you a preview of what our new adventure was, and here it is. I should have cleaned out their brooder first before making this video, but I was told to make a video. So here's our new adventure. 21 baby chicks. We built the coop the other day. They're about, let's see, two, maybe three weeks old in my care. She's a barred Plymouth Rock. She is an Americana. She's a barred Plymouth Rock. She's a, let me see here. It's, uh, I think that's my Rhode Island Red, because she's got a cross on her head. That's a Sapphire Gem. That's a Nosy. I got two Sapphire Gems, a light one and a dark one, two barred rocks. That is a Blue Lace Red Wine Dot. This is a California White. Oh no, hold on, I got one on my shoulder. Get off of my shoulder. Ugh. No! Uh-uh. Now it's on the floor. Okay, sorry, crisis averted. She went on a little stroll. That is a Easter olive egger. This black one right here is a Spanish Menorca. I have three of those. Hopefully, hopefully one of them is a rooster. I guess you don't hear that very often. That one over there on the roost is a starlight green. I have another olive egger somewhere. I think it's over there scratching. I have another Americana. It's a chocolate color over there scratching. So that's what I, oh. And that one, funny looking one right there with the two faced beak is a black Australorp. This is a silver laced wine dot. I have two of those. And so that here, y'all, is my baby chicks. They're about three weeks old now. I sit here, they're in a puppy playpen on top of a table and I sit in this chair and I talk to them every day. That's probably why that one was, they like to get out on my shoulder. That one does, that barred rock. So, that's what I do. Yep. Huh. Curiosity? Little fluffy booty. She's so pretty. That was in the Americana. But anyway, they're set up. My husband made them a perch. That's a radiant flat heater. And we put a box on top of it so they wouldn't poop on the heater. Well, they poop on the box. We got two drinkers. Today's clean out day. So they get fresh new litter and fresh new water. My husband built this water stand for them so they're, they wouldn't spill their water containers over and so they'd be high enough up for the bigger birds. The white birds are and the barred rocks are growing faster than the other birds. This is a squirrel proof bird feeder. They can't get in there and scratch the feed out which eliminates a lot of wasteful feed. See? She can't do it. They try but they can't do it. Over there is their dust bath but they eat 90% of the sand that we put in there. I have them some grit, but they don't like the grit. Or they peck at it some, but they'd rather dig and eat in the sand. But anyways, join us on our new adventure. Chick chicken keeping at the Kelly Homestead.